Hey everybody, Lance Koike here, and today I want to discuss liver glycogen. So, the liver is <laughs> very complex, and I think that people avoid it because it's so complex, and it doesn't seem so flashy, like it doesn't get real huge when you exercise or anything like your muscles do, and so it's easy to forget about. And I say all this probably because it's true for me, and maybe not anyone else. Um, but I have recently come to discover that the liver is very, very important and very complicated. Um, what I want to talk about now is, is just liver glycogen and not even all of it. Um, the basic principle here is there's two spots where you're storing most of your glycogen. It's in the muscle all throughout your body and it's in the liver. And so the reason that it's in the liver is because it's, it's highly uh, integrated with the cardiovascular system. So it can secrete, it can, you know, glycogen is a stored form of glucose. There's a bunch of different glucose molecules. It just cleaves one off and puts it into the bloodstream. And from there, it can go anywhere. Wherever I am, you know, depleted of glucose, it can start to go in that cell. And if it's during a workout, it's going to be during, uh, or it's going to be your muscle. So I might get a lot of my intro workout energy from my muscle glycogen, but I also get a lot of it from my liver glycogen as well. So we have to remember not to forget about that. Now, after I've had a really large workout or a really long workout, maybe I've depleted those stores or mostly depleted those stores, maybe not completely, but mostly depleted them, then um, I need to not just look into replenishing the glycogen in the muscle, but also in the liver. Now, the, the fix is the same thing. You have to eat some carbohydrates. And generally, you know, you have a little bit more time. Your cells start to put, especially your muscle cells, put these glucose transporters, GLUT4 transporters, into the muscle cells. And as the blood passes by it, it sees that glucose transporter, glucose can hop on it and it can push it into the muscle. And that's where we store it. Um, similar idea with the liver. Like every, every cell that needs glucose needs to transport it, needs help transporting it because it's so big. Um, and yeah, that's, that's that. Uh, <laughs> so Liver glycogen, second biggest storage form of it. Don't forget about it. Make sure that you're replenishing it after a workout. Um, if it's an easy workout, you probably don't need to worry about it too much. You'll probably replenish it over the you know next coming hours before your next workout. If you've had a really hard workout, then definitely prioritize. Maybe you have a few more carbohydrates to help replenish that liver glycogen so that you have the energy to do a really hard workout next time you're in the gym.